Hey! Hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm actually gonna continue. I'll, I'll work on the Cloud Kingdom later, even though you probably thought I was gonna do it this far, because I thought, nah, this, this is just too epic to leave as is, like, and just, like, break it up, you know? You know? <laughs> this is just too, too awesome. To stop now. We, we can go back to that Cloud Kingdom later on. Oh, I want to do a dive thing. Ah, whatever. So yeah, there's stuff hidden everywhere at Bowser's Kingdom Castle, so be sure to get yourself wherever you can get yourself because there's probably something hidden. Oh, oh well. Oh, no. Oh, oh, I can actually go on the other side of this now, can't I? Is there a Pokeo? Yes, there is! Yes, I can explore this side after all. Now, if you put your nose in, one, in these holes... Well, it looks like there might be a hole there, but there's not. But this one has a hole, though. <laughs> That's the only one that has a hole over here. Poking your nose in the plaster wall. So I guess it is plaster and not paper. Uh, I think there's actually something around this corner here. So I'm going to take a look-see. Oh, maybe there's not. Okay, and by the way, you do leave little holes in the wall in the wall with your Pokeo. Nice little detail. And you also chirp when you when <laughs> you jump. Uh, okay. Oh, this was the one that has stuff hanging off the edges of it. Careful with this now. You don't want to fling yourself into the abyss. Is it? Hello? How did I get stuck? Uh oh, am I stuck here forever? Okay. But yeah, there's uh, something down below. I'm pres I presume it's like lava or something like that. Maybe. Might be. It certainly seems plausible. Uh, I just want to see. Because I don't think I peeked off the left edge of this building. And... Uh, okay. <laughs> I even leaned my head off to the side <laughs> when I looked up at the building. That was com completely unnecessary. And we're off! Obviously, purple's right there off the bat. Second courtyard. I, I want the long jump, not hit my face on the. <laughs> okay, there we go. Get those over the edges. I, sh I should have probably just did that so I wouldn't have burned my butt, guaranteed. Eh, we're okay. I wonder if this was the place that I remembered that I had to put out the torches that I mentioned in the last part. This is a little tutorial on the bombs, obviously. <laughs> Just, so yeah. What you're supposed to do with these is kick them into other things using your Pokeo. I should say, peck them into other things using your Pokeo. And yeah, be be good with your pool shots here. Because you've got to get them lined up nice and right. Bingo! <laughs> another shard over here, so don't you forget about that. You can even put out the, the flame with the Pokeo. I'm, I'm never gonna get that shard, okay. <laughs> uh, I think there's actually another, whoop, another another thing up here in all boxes at once. E okay. I think there's something around these parts. As I always say, if you can get, if you can get to it in this game, there's probably something there. And there indeed is something there! Oh, oh! That's the Iron's Wall, isn't it? <laughs> I couldn't catch myself. <laughs> That's okay, I should still have the Moon Shards in my possession, though. Yeah, I still got the two there. Yeah, Alright. Well, anyway, I guess this place is relatively complete anyway, then. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and actually hit a bomb over to that side. I wanna see what's in those boxes. Nothing? Okay. I will take it. <laughs> it's fine. It's, if there's nothing, all is well. Just as long as I make sure I get everything. <laughs> well, as, as sure as I can be. By the way, there's some parts of the roof that you cannot hop yourself over because they're a little bit... Yeah, they got a little bit of a gutter to them. Well, I guess that's not a gutter. It's more like a veranda or... I guess you would going to call it an overhang. That's the word. <laughs> it's amazing when you get the right word. And... You know, no, 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 no! I drifted myself too far away from the wall. <laughs> That's why I said on the other route to be careful when you're dropping down for those purple coins. Because it's easy to do that. And I did it. <laughs> Alright, well at least we know this is cleared, so... Off we go! Nook. Okay. Try this again here with, with more carefulness. There we go! Magical! Uh, I'll get those on my way back! 
<laughs> I aimed the control stick in the wrong direction. And it was, by the time I could do another f nose poke, it was too late. Alright, try it again! <laughs> we'll get this. We'll get this eventually. I swear it! <laughs> uh, okay. I believe there is a moon shard down here. Look. Uh, just go. Yeah, off to that side, because then I can do something a little bit safer. <laughs> nice do a, do a nice low flick. Well, there's purples. That's pretty nice. Notice that you cannot. Yeah, you cannot flick your nose into that. That's a pretty sneaky one there, because you got the metal bar along the way there. I guess I won't have to go back actually. Oh wait! Oh, I will. <laughs> oh wait! No, I don't have to. That's right. There's a pipe over here that just takes us right back to the top. All right. No moon shards like I thought, but there was a moon treasure inside a turret. I'm gonna lose my Pokeo if I go in here. Yep. That's what I thought. But there's plenty more where that Pokeo came from. There's this Pokeo. <laughs> Okie dokie. And now we've got a pool ball, some more explosive balls around here. There's a something in this one because it glows, obviously. I think the last one is. Uh, up on the roof somewhere, I thought, but behind, they're around, there's something. We're gonna find out! <laughs> we just start from the top and go down. Uh, maybe it wasn't. Mm. Or maybe it was, I don't know. I just want to make sure I don't miss anything before I leap back down there. Oh, there's a hole over there! Maybe I was supposed to stick my nose in that. Stick my nose in Bowser's business. Look. Okay, well that's nice, but that's not what I'm looking for here. <laughs> hmm, might as well grab him while I'm... Oof, that was just absolutely terrible. As I say, might as well grab him while I'm wandering around here. Uh, okay, so I guess I'll just continue pool balling stuff until I get everything completed. Out of my way, bad boy. Uh, okay, no shard there. Look, how about in the corner? That got something? I was only, only able to destroy one of them, despite the explosion. Okay, really? Is it around the corner then? I don't remember it being around the corner. I was going to check this later, but I guess there's purples down there as well. It was. <laughs> Alright, I was wrong. It was there. Uh, so I guess I might as well hop down over there. Get the purples. Oh, no! <laughs> I I am never getting through this one, am I? <laughs> All right, here we go. Well, at least I don't have to do that side route again. <laughs> now I've got another side route that'll keep killing me, probably. <laughs> oh no! Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't bomb me, please. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> you, can, you can bomb me when I'm when I'm finished, dang it. Okay, I'll go off this way. And actually, maybe I'll start by looking along this little peak here. Eh, nothing, nothing. Yeah, okay. Eh, just might as well, you know. Let's take a look-see around. By the way, that yeah, that wall goes down pretty deep. And that those are some really dangerous purples to get. So I might as well get them now. <laughs> oh wait, I can't? Really? Okay, fine. I'll just go like this. Ah! Alright, now I'm gonna go carefully down. Very, very carefully time it. Very, very carefully time it. Get it? Got it? Good. That's how I'm gonna do this. By the way, if you just release the analog stick, you, you're always facing the wall, like when you're in midair like that. So, when I was pointing myself off to the side, I really didn't have to do that at all. <laughs> I, I forgot about that until I just realized it at that point, so I actually could have made that a lot easier than it actually was. Anyway, Moon Shards are a go! Smart bombing is a done. But are they as good as Bomberman's remote bombs? Eh, probably not. But they sure are fun to knock around. Okay, well, I ended up clearing that place out pretty thoroughly. Big brutal battle. Uh oh. Oh. Well, there were two that we didn't have a rematch on yet, weren't there? Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. No. I also think there's something up 
over around this. Yeah, I think there was something up around this way. Uh, one, two, buckle my shoe, three, four. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Does that say three, four, dive some more? But no, nah, I just grabbed onto the edge. All right, there's that. But I could have swore that there was a moon inside the structure as well. Some, well, up above the structure, that's, that's something. <laughs> On the side of all the castle gates. Pretty descriptive once again. Uh, but yeah, I thought there was a way, to, oops, a way to get inside one of these. I don't know if it was this one, I don't know if it was another one, but I just want to be sure here. You see, there's those little, those bars over there. And maybe I only thought I could get inside this one because of those bars and I never actually got inside one of them. I don't know. Nah, I think we just move on though. And whoa, there's a shop! Bowser has a shop! What the poop? <laughs> Might as well hit this checkpoint at the souvenir shop. And I guess we could probably buy ourselves a moon. But oh, what the poop! What are you doing here? <laughs> it's like, you want to get a look see what's going on inside? You gotta be dressed for battle, friend. You look much like a samurai. Oh, man! Maybe there's something we can do about that. I think there's actually, yeah, purple coins in on top of here. One, two, three. Beautiful. I think I actually got enough coins to be a samurai. Uh, you know, purple coins. Okay, I guess I could do that then. I don't know. It sounds like a, something that I probably should do as long as I'm here. My, just go ahead and... Well, first, let's buy, buy a moon. Hey, thank you, thank you. It's pretty friendly up here at Bowser's Kingdom. <laughs> and... Moon bot! There wasn't any new items there that I seen, because they always appear near the left side, just as like a little quick organization thing, so that you can quickly run that over. Oh yeah, I do have enough to buy this stuff. Nice! So it looks like we're gonna be a samurai! Fitting for this ultimate battle upcoming! <laughs> sure... This, uh, this looks a little on the heavy side, though. Eh, should work just fine. By the way, little Hanafuda cards here. These are probably my favorite sticker, because I actually have a Hanafuda card set from Club Nintendo. <laughs> you know what? I'm buying it now! You can't tell me not to. <laughs> I'll leave the rest of the stuff for later. <laughs> I don't know why. It just doesn't really much matter if I do, because it'll, it'll give me the coin count that pops up above my head as I go anyway, but yeah. Anyway, you can see the... The uh, Hanafuda cards hanging out back there, good times, and now that I am a samurai, I am ready to tackle what is behind the shop. Eh, it's probably just the workers. <laughs> you look like a samurai, well, step right in, okay. <laughs> thank you, thank you. And, uh oh, 8 bit time. <laughs> this is really cool, by the way. <laughs> I knew it was back here. Whoop! <laughs> The whole thing scrolls, by the way. Well, I should say it flips around uh, when we get this. You'll see. And we got nice 8-bit music going on here as well. To boot. Is there anything? Okay, I just wanted to see. These only go down so far, though, if I recall. Oh, they don't. Oh, <laughs> they go down all the way. I guess I was thinking of uh, the moving ones from uh, New Super Mario Brothers series, where they go down, like, down and up like a seesaw. Yeah, okay. So don't stay on those too long. <laughs> All right. Next. <laughs> so this could go on infinitely if they really wanted to. Infinitely. But will it? That is the question. The question is... Well, I should say the answer is maybe. This could go on for years, for all we know. Maybe we'll never get out of here. Maybe we'll never see... The light of day again because of this one. Oh, this is gonna be tricky because of this one area of doom. Yeah, I think a moon's gonna appear up on top. Oh, really? I was going for the platform and I, I, I was one pixel off. <laughs> I have to redo that, aren't I? That was one of the two moons there. I, th I think that was the first moon. I, I mean, I think there was two moons here. Excuse me. So, yeah, anyway, I should probably just run through this now. It's just a little, little bit swifter now that I've showed you the collect-a-thon here. <laughs> I thought I'd get everything. Alright, 
So now this time I'm just gonna run over to this one. There we go. Please tell me the moon is still there. Dang it! Because <laughs> this is actually a pretty scary one to, to deal with because of the... Uh, ooh, that's... well, it's not what I was going for. Oh, it, it actually got me a couple of notes there. Hmm, maybe I could use that to my advantage. <laughs> okay, so now I know that it pops up there and I didn't have to loop around after all. I thought I actually had the... it was gonna appear on top of those blocks in the middle. I was wrong. And it continues. Now, this one's a tricky one. What you gotta do is you gotta time this so that you sink this down so it destroys the blocks. Pretty cool, right? <laughs> that should be good enough, actually. Voila! Scene of crossing the poison swamp. Yeah, it's a, it's a scene, basically, that we're in. And... Done! <laughs> <laughs> Love that. Uh, I don't know if this is open up to me right now, but it might be. Uh, yeah, you, you can take over the statues. Anyone you please. And what we're supposed to do is put them over here. <laughs> yep, it's an empty spot. So guess what we need to put over there? Oh, 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 yeah, there we go. I guess I can do this right now. I just remember getting this post game, probably because I missed it on my first time around, but there we go. Beautiful! <laughs> uh, I think there's also... I think I gotta put one there too, yeah. This one's obviously a lot, a lot closer to home. So this one I did find on my first run through here. There we go! <laughs> Fantastic! And we got two moons. Out of Bowser's Zen Garden. He's probably not too happy about that. He's gonna have to re redo this place because we ruined his entire Zen. And we're off. <laughs> That's Bowser's problem, not ours. And we're here. Where are we here, though? That is the question. Well, a double boss arena. That's where. Checkpoint. The courtyard entrance. Pick your poison. <laughs> Yep, the remaining two! Just as I said, we haven't had a rematch versus these two. Yep, the wedding's almost here! The Bowser boss is getting ready and the keep up ahead. But you two could scram, cause you're definitely not invited! It's Harriet's rematch! Bring it on! And we wait for the spike balls, you know this deal. We get their bombs, what the poop? You don't hit- she doesn't automatically throw her hair down into an automatically, like, dangerous area This like, make herself vulnerable right away? No, she does not, and look what we can do with her bombs if we get ourselves set up right. <laughs> we can actually eliminate her cycle, I don't think I showed that before. And yep, that is another way of defeating Harriet, so enjoy your newfound knowledge and defeat Harriet in record time. Oh! I just missed her. At least I think I just missed her. No, no, no. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's okay. Just gotta wait for things to get back in decent position here. Uh, actually, throw them to a more wide area here, please. Thank you. And now I can do that. And knock your noodle one more time. Too bad for you. You're out. And the statue indicator that there is a boss there is a goner. I didn't even really have much trouble with that at all. Next up is, of course, Topper. The finale of the rematches. <laughs> the Bowser boss wasn't kidding you. He said you two are persistent. But I owe it to the family. To all the spewer Topper. Wait, you mean yourself? I guess so. <laughs> to come at you on everything I got! Bring it on! And he has upgraded his hats, I, I guess. So it's a, I guess it's a little bit more difficult in that regard when more hats start appearing on the scene, because you get more hats than ever now. By the way, um, whenever you're in an area with a whole bunch of bouncing stuff, stay near the edges of things. It makes, it makes things a whole lot easier to deal with things. Careful, careful, careful. Yeah, if you don't get the hats off in time, he's gonna do that spin attack, and the more the more hats he's whoops, the more hats he's got, 
the deadlier he is. His hat is, uh, it's this one in the middle of, well, I thought it was. Which one had his hat? Dang it. <laughs> well, okay, there we go. Alright, okay, why don't you just do your, do your spinny thingy here. There you go, I just wanted to get that out of the way here. <laughs> and I just realized I'm at one health, kind of, kind of, whoa! Kind of in a dangerous predicament there, yeah. I should be a little more, a little bit more careful than I have been. <laughs> Actually, come to think of it, I think there was a, um, a life increaser around this area. Well, there's that, but I mean like around the perimeter of the area. I thought, I just want to show really quick. Oh, well, you can move this around, of course, but I don't, I don't remember if this needs to go anywhere. Or maybe I just move it out of the way and the ground found the spot that it was at? Maybe? I don't remember. I just want to see it really quick. Hmm. Okay, so it wasn't this side. Yeah, which side had the life up shroom? I forgot. Hmm, there's a painting that's obviously not a life up shroom. Hmm, you can hit the lanterns around, that does not give a life up shroom. Okay, maybe there isn't one here. No, maybe this is actually the one time where it's actually beneficial to buy a life life increasing shroom from the shop. It's not that our uh, brutal friend here is that difficult or anything like that, but you know, you know, it's just a thing of precautions, I guess. But you like there you really usually is one before a boss, but no, not this time. That's okay. <laughs> Oh, no, don't, don't want to get caught by the... Yeah, remember, stay near the edges, PK Gam. Don't go against your own advice. Yeah, I don't remember which one his, his regular hat was. Oh, man. Yeah, there we go. As long as I rush him. I mean, I'm at, I'm at full health now, so I'm in a lot better predicament than I was before. I don't know. I don't know which one was the one. That's okay. Ooh, that's not good. I was gonna say, that's okay. Whoa, 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 wait. Better get this. There we go. Okay, so that was the one. I'm gonna go do a couple hat tricks. And... See if I can knock them off before he recharges his spin. There we go. Ah! Yeah! Victory! Once again. Yeah, Topper definitely got upgraded there. <laughs> Probably the most upgraded boss out of all the Brutals, actually. So, yeah, I mean, Spirit, Spirit is boom boom, so... <laughs> Alright! Big Brutal battle is complete! And with that, this door and, well, platform opens up, and we can go over to the next area. You know, really, Bowser could have just could have just left things as is, just kept everything closed up, we would have never reached them. Just like, just perma-lock this with super glue or something like that. <laughs> and man, we got a whole change of music and atmosphere and everything like that in this area. It would be a shame if I ended off the part here, but that's what I'm going to have to do. So with that, I'm going to end off the video here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I explore the rest of the castle.